Without tuna tubes, you can't keep live blackfin tunas or bonitas alive at all. You can put them in your live well, but they won't stay alive more than 20 seconds. Okay. Now the idea with the tuna tubes is the whole thing is no more than 19 seconds, no less than 19 seconds to fill up. And that's like the ideal, you know, flow rate for tunas. What are tuna tubes and why do you, why did you install them on every single boat you have here and what do you guys use them for? Well, a lot of boats didn't fish big tunas here. It's kind of a West Coast thing, like Cabo San Lucas, California, a lot of boats have them. A lot, a lot in the Baja Peninsula, and I fished down in Cabo a few seasons and saw them. So I wanted to be able to fish some bigger baits, and your regular live wells will not keep them alive. The only way to keep them alive is a tuna tube. So that's why I installed them on all our boats. Um, we can we have three on either side on each boat, and it you know it's beneficial to catch big wahoos. We've caught big sharks, marlin, um, big barracudas. Um, you, you'll be surprised when you drop a big tuna on a wreck what you can catch. So if you're a recreational guy, um, there's a company, I would have to look it up, but you can just Google tunatubes.com or tuna tubes for sale. There's a company that makes a two banger and a four banger that you can just mount to anything on your boat. You can use your saltwater wash down to plumb it and anybody that has a center console or any type of smaller vessel can do the same thing that we can do on these big sport fishing boats. Okay. Please like and subscribe to our channel. We're going to be putting out videos on a regular basis. Um, uh, we're going to do how-to videos of rigging, um, knots, uh, how to catch big fish.